Shots uh, both in Nigeria and New Orleans in the um, United States, and I can tell you, it's actually something to look forward to. I play the role of Zaria, um, who would be the lead opposite Kenneth, who plays Ike. So I played the character of Princess in the movie Different Worlds. Yeah, I totally loved the character when I first saw the script, in the sense that um, <laughs> it was something different. You know how princesses really get what they want, but this was um, totally different. She didn't really <laughs> have her way as she thought she would. When I first got the script, I was definitely interested in telling the story. It is a love story, which I'm excited to play. And it also has such a variety of characters that are really colorful and lively once before we actually shot um, or before he came down for filming so he met with me the night before filming just to kind of go over our characters and how we felt about each other so that we would be on the same page for filming um, so we only had a couple hours with each other before filming and doing this entire movie which is a little different but um, he's a great actor so I felt really comfortable I would say most challenging part is anything that involves being in love or lovey-dovey, that kind of stuff. I've never had a role where I had to be intimate or a kiss or be held by anybody. I'm normally more of a tough girl. Um, so that would probably be the most challenging part, especially working with someone who I really don't know. <laughs> um, it's kind of hard to have chemistry with someone who you just met, but that's why we're actors. Yeah, I mean, on every set, there's like one or two technical issues. So yeah, but there were like much challenges as well. Maybe like maybe like one health issue or one technical issue, and that was it. Then um, here in Nigeria, like you know, I think it was the weather. We must have like you know, like serious seas and everything, and it rained, you know, for hours. So that kind of affected us. But as I said, like everything was good. Nigeria has been good. Um, very welcoming. Everyone here is very friendly different type of production than the States, but that's what I was looking for, was a different experience, and that's kind of what I got. It's interesting to see how Nollywood works versus Hollywood. Definitely a lot more fast-paced, but people are very passionate about their work, and that's what I'm drawn to. Um, working with Chris has been great. He's direct. Um, I like how he approaches the actors. He gives us enough creative freedom, but also guides us. That's really been a pleasure. That's pretty much the, exactly the same in the United States. Uh, very straight to the point and giving you enough freedom as an actor to grow and kind of experience the character as you'd like to. Working with um, Austin Obuefi, I must say he's a very calm and you know gentle young man, and he's quite you can relate with him. Um, so about my character, I'm one of the maidens in the palace, one of the most trusted maidens in the palace. You know, I am um, about my character. I am so I don't know. I don't want to tell you guys. So when the movie comes out, because I don't want to you know. Um, bring the skeleton out of the cover, just wait for the movie to come out and you can see my character in full form. I'm Juan Grimano, known as Bobby Guru. I play the role of a guard in the movie Different Worlds, directed by Chris Energy. Chris Energy is one of Nigeria's best or leading directors. He's very good, so to Different Worlds, say thumbs up.
amazing director by the name of Terrence who really wanted to capture the city on a local vibe versus what's normally seen in movies or TV shows. So that made it really fun. To Darcy, Kenneth, um, they were amazing cast. I think it was just a perfect casting. Um, I haven't worked with her before. It's the first time working with her and it was pretty easy working with her. And Kenneth, I have also worked with him a couple of times and um, it, it was nice. The blend was beautiful. If I was given the opportunity, I'd love to come back and give it another shot. It'd be fun to kind of see how different sets are. Um, like the States, you have different types of productions. Um, so I'd like to see how different productions work down here. Director, Chris. Chris is someone that I have worked with over time and I have really loved um, his work and the style of um, the way he directs. So he's like an actor's director. He comes to your level. You can air your opinions and you know, he's not like all about, I'm a director. <laughs> it was the first time also um, meeting with him and I think he did an amazing job bringing the Nollywood and Hollywood combination in our own story and telling it fantastically well. So I think it's beautiful. Sure, I met Austin about a year and a half ago um, at Launch Mall and Talent. He was learning more about the acting in Hollywood South. Uh, we've been working pretty much ever since then on putting this movie out and when he approached me with wanting to shoot something, I jumped at the offer. What an amazing opportunity to be able to shoot something in the United States and be able to come to Nigeria and shoot it here. So, it so happened that uh, you know, I came up with the idea and then uh, I did pretty much an idea for a royal family movie. So, um, I came up with the idea and then uh, I, I, I met with uh, the script writer you know, by name Tamara, you know, it's an American lady. I met with her and then I told her my story. You know, we just wanted, I told her my story and she said, okay, we can, you know, we can write it up and, you know, get it going. So after she wrote it, uh, I read the script, it was amazing. It was really amazing. So I spoke with my American director by name, uh, Terence Rosemont. You know, he read the script and he was like, look, man, we gotta do this movie. This movie is awesome, we gotta do it. The script is awesome, we gotta do it. So the next thing I did, uh, I had to call my Nigerian, uh, you know, director, you know, which you guys know, amazing guy, uh, Miss Chris uh, Energy, uh, you know, who directed my previous movie, Threesome. Uh, Threesome went all the way to the States, premiered it all over the United States, and then, uh, you know, uh, it got a lot of uh, press reviews, uh, you know, went viral pretty much, you know. And then uh, he did an awesome job with that movie, and I was like, well, he's the guy that's gonna do this movie. So I talked with him and then he asked me to send the script to him. So I sent him the script and he read the script and he was like, look man, we have to do this movie. I played the role of Ada, the mischievous maid in the palace. Oh my goodness, just watch out for this character. You know, you won't see it coming at all. About the cast, uh, Uncle Kofi, all the way from Ghana. He's such a very cool man and I love him. We have Auntie um, Ngozi Zanu, Kenneth Okoli, M.M. Ufort, um, Liliana Soro, and we have Tadase Young all the way from the USA, our American princess. She's so down to earth, and I love her. So it's been an amazing shoot. We have fun, you know, on set all the time. So we work like family here, work like team, you know. So watch out for the movie Different Worlds. It's coming out very soon, and it's going to be a banger, you know. Hey guys, my name is Kenneth Cody. Look out for the movie Different Worlds, okay, directed by Chris Energy and Terence Rosemore, and executive produced by Austin Wiki. Stay tuned, this movie is going to blow your mind. And this is Different Worlds, produced by Austin Obwefi and directed by Chris Inaji. <laughs> Watch out for it, it'll be coming for you soon. Hi guys, this is your girl again, Lilian Nisoro, telling you all to watch out for different worlds. Trust me, this one is totally different from everything you've seen all around the world. <laughs> this was um, put together by Austin and it was directed by Chris Enning. Um, we have fantastic acts on this one, so you all should watch out for this. Your tracks today.